Dear Dead Name, there are so many things I want to tell you. So many things I wish you'd known before you had to go. I still think about you. You cross my mind a lot. I think about all the things that won't happen because you aren't here anymore. You won't be the first girl to do something incredible. All those things you wished to achieve, all the things they told you you couldn't because you were a girl. You may not be able to achieve those dreams, but I hope you know I didn't forget about them. Dear Dead Name, the first time I signed my name, I wrote yours. The shock of seeing how easily the pen flew across the paper to spell out your name was incredible. It took me time to unengrave that scrawl we'd practiced so often. I still do that. It happens a lot. I'll find myself tracing your name over and over again. At least, it will never be forgotten. However much I wish it could be, seeing your name, hearing your name caused me so much chaos in my head. Thoughts of you come flying back, filling my head with positive and negative memories. Unfortunately, none of them are truly happy, because even the memories I make today aren't really happy. I will forever be sunk in dread with the knowledge that you don't and cannot exist anymore. You caused me so much misery. I wish I could have gotten rid of you earlier before I had reasons to stay attached. The memories are like glue, so many keeping us together, disabling you from leaving completely. You will always be there, in the back of my head, screaming at me, making this guilt I feel almost unbearable. I hope one day I'm able to drown out that screech. Dear Dead Name, I remember how unhappy you were, how every feminine thing made you die inside. You never knew who you wanted to be because you never thought you'd make it past the age of 18. I'm looking forward to the date of my 18th birthday. I'll be able to say you were right. You did not make it to that age, but I will, and I will live long past that. Dear Dead Name, I finally found my purpose. That thing we looked around every corner and every crack for, you never found your purpose. You didn't survive long enough to. But I know mine. I'm going to help people like you. Those who struggled with daily life because what they do feels wrong. I'll provide a sanctuary of knowledge for those who live as you did. Constantly yelling at yourself for being unable to fit in because you thought you didn't belong. Dear Dead Name, I really wish that when you left you could have taken your body with you. Living with this is practically unbearable. The high squeal of the voice you dropped on my throat caused me to cry at night. The curves you've left me to suffer with are ones I wish I never had to look at and the breasts that you abandoned at my doorstep, I'm getting rid of those. I know you always wanted that. In the back of your mind, you always wish they hadn't ever arrived. I hate that we had to suffer through the earthquake called female puberty. I would give anything to reverse that. Dear dead name, there are times I miss you. When I'm around my family, I question if when they see me, they look for you. How they might wonder if, had you stayed, maybe I'd have worn a dress to prom. Maybe I'd have morphed to what society wanted me to be. I wonder if they miss you. Dear dead name, I still see you. In the mirror, in any reflection, I wish I didn't. You make it so hard for me to step outside every day. I fear they can't see me. I fear you've managed to crawl from my mental images of you out onto my skin that maybe you've polluted it so that only you are there, making it impossible for me to be seen. Dear dead name, I'm sorry. I ended your life so that I could live. I wish there had been a way for us to coexist. Unfortunately, there wasn't, at least not one that would provide me happiness. Dear dead name, I will never forget you, and I hope you don't hate me, I'm sorry.